And that song that we just heard tonight by Mr. Mm-hmm. Walt Anderson from Making the yeah. Band. That joint was popping, like. Thank you. Make me wanna uh never mind. So <laughs> like that. But I do wanna say thank you so much for coming up here, by the way. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it. I you already know, like I would love for you to come back if you could one day, you know. Yeah. Maybe we can have Ellie on the ground, keep it going, even though I'm gonna graduate, maybe you know what I'm saying? Yep. Even though we throwing that joint right in rotation anyway, so you already know. We're gonna be hosting the next hottest joint soon, so we'll be up at that joint. <laughs> Where Ma- major in? radio. Yeah, she's gonna be a big market. Somewhere. Yeah, yeah, somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 We call, we call, no, yeah, I call Melly Mel for me and get you on one of the kids. Well, you, well, you, kiss down there. if you could do I that, know Mally, though, because I've been knocking on his door plenty of times and he is not trying to open it up. Yeah. You feel me? <laughs> yeah. And I need the opportunity. But I heard they're supposed to be closing in a couple really? months. Yeah, somebody bought them. Mm-hmm. And I need that that uh, internship. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I need a song sponge. That's the only thing. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I that's the only thing about radio, man. I mean, you, you know the business. It's mm-hmm. tough. You can go in there one day. The locks has changed. Some it's, they changed the format on you. Just but like it's that. crazy though because it's gonna be no other urban station in Delaware after this. I know. That's Hold sad. On, well, wait a minute. I seen. What's Power 101.7? That's Merlin. Do you get them stations? And then 101.7 is Kiss. Well, it's another one I've I, I seen on Instagram. It's um, some Power. But I think that's like Ocean City, Merlin. Y'all can't get that from there. Nah. Oh, that's right? OC 104. OC 103 or yeah. something OC like that? OC 104. Mm-hmm. Okay, 104. Yeah, that's all the way down there in like the Ocean City, Maryland, Baltimore. DC. You can't get that in Delaware? Mm-hmm. Not up top by Newark, nah. Yeah. Not by Wilmington and all that. So I need to hit, like, if I can't hit Kiss, then I got to go to, like, Philly with it. Like, I would try. I would, well, yeah, you can do that. Because we can hear Power 99, 96.5. Yeah. Yeah, so we can hear that. That's crazy. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. So go ahead. You brought your other boy up here. Go ahead and introduce your man. We got a legend, you know what I'm saying? DJ Dre Money in the building. In here. Legend, wow. Legend. <laughs> to me, to me. I grew up listening to those mixtapes and all that. To me, a legend. And the world will know that too. That's I appreciate thing. that, Prince. Thank you, man. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> that makes me want to cry. That's big. You know, I'm humble. I'm humble. We're humble guys, you know what I mean? Word. So, all right. So, you say you grew up listening to, you know, him. Like, what different CDs or things that were you listening to? I mean, there's one CD that's a classic. It was... Um, Straight Money and Marvels, that makes sense. Oh, I had a rapper? Yes. Yeah, yeah that, that is, that's, 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 that's a classic. Yeah, that's yeah. I just spoke to Marvel last yesterday, by the way. One of my people. Yeah. Shout out Marvels, Free Marvels. He's mm-hmm. a heck of a rapper, man. Yeah. yeah. Good guy. And I heard you got bars, too. You're not just a DJ. Yeah, well, see, I ain't, I'm not that spitter type guy like that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm, like, to see my, my, my single, Dad in Life, featuring Mr. Walter Anderson right here, mm-hmm. um, it's smooth. It's, you know what I'm saying? It's not that, you know, shoot him up, bang, bang. Yeah, ain't nobody for that. Nah, nah. It's, it's a, <laughs> I, I'm trying to bring back the, you know, when we was talking about chivalry, like whining and dining a girl and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, like that that's like, a story. Yeah, it's like a lost art. Like what happened to like, you know I was thinking that the other day. Rapping about the chicks, like and not being a side chick and stuff like that. You know what the I'm saying? The main chick. Yeah. You know? Yeah. So that, that's there's side chicks out here around thinking that it's cool. Exactly. And, and it's it, not. You're right. You're right. And they're making it. And, and that's why now it's so many side chicks. Yeah. So many. And, and we don't proud. need that. We don't need that. You know what I'm saying? They just wrecking homes, eh? It's not good for that. Yeah, it's not. So, like you said, I was just thinking about trying to bring back music that tells stories like Tupac. Biggie, like those type, that type of era, I'm, like I'm definitely. But see, first, hold up. First, I'm a DJ, so like as he said, I'm just a DJ mainly. But I start messing around with some stuff because, like, I would get some nice beats from different producers, and I was like, wow, ain't nobody using this stuff. So then I would just, you know, sit down and write it and co-write it with my partner, and then me and Walt get in the studio, and then you know he'll start Imagine. coming up with the hook, and then we, you know, it just comes together like that. Mm-hmm. But Prince, like, sort of what he's on is kind of what I'm on, like, more of, like, the DJ Khaled type thing. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. But, but that actually song, Day in the Life, I'm actually, you know, rapping on, on that it. myself. Yeah, Word. so so I'm like a mixture between, like, a DJ Khaled and, like, a Puff, like a Diddy, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So, you know what I mean? Some some records, I will actually rap on myself, and then most of them, I'm just screaming over them in the beginning. DJ, train, buddy! <laughs> like, oh, God, Prince! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, it. yeah, yeah, I'm more like that. So that's more where I'm at with it. I'm not trying to Word, be like, Word. come a rapper, 
Well, you know, I fast. If it matters, well, you know, here and there, you know he might drop a single or two. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, drop some records, you know what I mean? Hit records. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going for hit records. I'll let everybody else make the album fillers, you know? Yeah. Right. Yeah. So. so what big project you got going on right now that you're working on? I'm putting this album together called Living a Dream. It's a compilation album. Um, uh, Knife Prince, is, he's involved on it. Um, oh, Walt right. Anderson, um, working with this artist that I've been working with forever. His name is Francis Fire. Um... He's a genius, musical genius, um, producer named Q Will. They're all from around my way, where I'm from. And where are you from? We're from Coatesville. Oh, all right. Coatesville, PA. We, we like 20 minutes from this Yeah. Country, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, you know a couple people from Coatesville. We know some people. Just a couple. Oh, yeah. My P.O. Shout out to my P.O. Donna yeah. Brown. Right. <laughs> 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 yeah. Well, she's not my P.O. anymore, but she was. Shout she out to Donna Brown. She's not my P.O. for said, I'm not people. a bad chick. One of them. I now you don't seem like it at all. Mm, we all had some things happen. You know what I mean? It so, was my younger days. My younger days. I chilled out now. I'm I'm cool. Like that's cool. I got my baby now, so I'm cool. Mm, that's cool. You yeah. belong. You belong here on radio. Yeah, right? yeah, you know exactly, right? exactly. exactly. Yeah. <laughs> it works. So, why are you coming out with this green CD? You gonna have Prince and Walt on there? You got any girl rappers on there? Nah, we can talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let's make it happen. You need a little woo-woo-woo? No, I'm serious. We can make that happen. You need a little bit of that? Yeah, let's make it happen, man. All right, well, that's cool. I got this record uh, called Diva that uh, me and Walt will be uh, going in production, well, going in the studio to record it, actually, probably within the next few weeks here. So I'm going to try to wrap the project up by, like, early summer. Where you just gonna go on like a tour? Yeah, it? yeah, we're gonna we're gonna come back here. I'm gonna come back here. I'm gonna spend live for y'all. We are gonna set the turntables up. Yeah, here. I wish we could have done yeah, that today. Yeah, I, I actually was prepared. You know, shout I got out that. to the BSers that just pulled out today. Yeah, shout out. I ain't gonna put y'all on blast. Y'all messed shout out. out. I was gonna come tear the place down. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, you know I'm saying I'm, that's but, terrible. Well, it's okay. Because we always got the future, so we yeah. don't get a popping either way. Absolutely. Word. We can throw parties, come, all that. Yeah, all that. I heard this right across the whole. I used to actually DJ out here. Um, right. Yeah, probably a while back. You probably you probably wasn't here that like it probably was like oh seven oh eight something like I that. I got here on nine. Oh, okay, yeah. So right before that. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, I used to DJ. It was a little small. It wasn't in this building. Well, somewhere around here, though. It's on campus? Yeah, yeah, on campus. Oh, okay. And um, actually, we performed out here, too. Uh, on the stage, right? What was it, Homecoming? <clears throat> was that Homecoming? We uh, opened up for uh, Miguel. Miguel, yeah. Yeah. For Spring Fling? For Spr yeah, Spring yeah. Fling, yeah. Oh, that's fun. That was like two years ago, I think. Yeah, it was not that long ago. Yeah. So I was out here spinning on the stage. Oh, Then my man DJ Graham, <laughs> DJ uh, <laughs> Damage, they came in and rocked the party afterwards. You know, so. That's uh, popping. Yeah. All right, well, that don't mean, you know, we can come back up here and turn up again. Yeah, that's what I said. I'm going to come back. Where... I'm going to come back before you graduate. I don't want to, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, my Pop graduation it. party. I'm trying to turn All right. up. Let me know. I'll come rock it for you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't even know where I'm going to be at. Probably around here. Maybe Philly, Delaware. Maybe, you know, I got to throw pay me a party in Philly, Delaware, and school. How about that? Mm -hmm. Three parties. Like Give me one of them dates. I'll come rock it for you. I right. tour, I go all across the country, you know what I mean? DJ for him, he travels. And Let me do a couple numbers, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> word, word. Um, Get on stage, rock it, but you got to sing to me, though. You can't put no other girl on stage but me. My, uh, my woman crest Wednesday. I can't <laughs> say that. Like, nah. All right, well, thanks. All right, cool. Well, it's a and make, and make, your plug. make sure y'all hit me up. Hit Walt Anderson up. We all on social media mm -hmm. and whatnot. Um, Walt is at Walt on the Keys. At Walt on the Keys. Um, I am at DJ Drake Money, everything, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, whatever, I'm on there. Hey. I'm still on MySpace, too. Hey. <laughs> no, you did not just say that. You did not just I, say that. That was a joke. That was a joke. <laughs> Prince up. He everywhere. Instagram, yeah. Facebook, Twitter, whatever. No, AOL. I had to drop. Messenger. What? I, I had to drop the MySpace free. That's where it all originated from. Yeah. yeah. I, I mean, I was, we all started on MySpace. MySpace yeah. was popping. Yeah. yeah. It was, it was popping. As his friends, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. It's you can make your own page, put music yeah. on it. Yeah. <laughs> I, I actually tried to log in the other day because it was a song that um, this, the artist Marvels that we were just talking about uh, recorded on our Hammer Walt did. A while back, and I tried to log. I forgot my password. Though, oh so man, you can't do that. Long ago. Yeah, <laughs> like, I tried to log too long ago. Yeah, but but thanks for having us, though. You already really know. Appreciate you already know. Thank you. You already know. It. So you about to drop your One Nation? I saw you bring me in spring now. 
Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be a three part series, you know what I'm saying? All Spring, right. summer, and then fall. So, all right, it's definitely going down. Hey, got, well, you still keep surprises. working. Hey, yeah. well, I can't wait till you drop that drums. I heard you got a little surprise for us today, though. Yeah, definitely. My new single, you know what I'm saying? Fat Joe featuring Jennifer Lopez, stressing off of the One Nation. It's crazy. Word, listen to that drop too, though. You know, L9 Prince, you yeah, know. <laughs> Sorry, not, but we're gonna go ahead and rock that. And then we're gonna go to commercial after that. It's a little small. We're gonna come back. We're gonna wrap today's shows up. All right. Hey. <laughs>